So this is just an action-packed minute or so to help you prepare for Sunday 25th of March message. We're going to be looking at Galatians together and Galatians chapter 4 verses 1 to 15. Uh, sorry, 1 to 7, and I encourage you, as always, to be reading that ahead of the message. Read it and pray that God might speak to you as you look at it, not just listening to what I or somebody else might have to say. Our title for the message is going to be Heirs, Not Slaves. Heirs, Not Slaves. And uh, here's a few things to get you thinking before then. We're going to start with the Japanese proverb, and that goes like this. Kaeru no ko wa kaeru. Kaeru no ko wa kaeru. A child of a frog is a frog. Hmm. I'll give you something to think about. And here's our first table talk question, which is this. What have you already inherited from your parents? What have you already inherited from your parents? Uh, we're answering that from all kinds of different ages. And some of you, your parents are living. Some of them uh, are no longer with you. Nevertheless, we can all answer the question. Uh, what have you inherited from your parents? And then the second question, uh, getting topical. On Friday, that's yesterday as I record this, the High Court quashed charges of theft and false accounting against many former postmasters. If you were one of their children, how has your inheritance changed? Okay, I know it's getting a bit complicated and you've got to think about different things to work that one out. But it's really, if you think of the plight of these postmasters, it's been quite an emotional journey for them and their families. So if you were one of the children of these postmasters who've just had all those charges acquitted, how has your inheritance changed? I hope that gets you thinking and I look forward to seeing you. Uh, as we pray prayerfully, get ready for the Sunday's message.